Today would have been beloved actress Betty White's 100th birthday and to honor the TV legend and longtime animal lover, a viral nationwide campaign has been started. It's called the Betty White Challenge and joining us to tell us more about it is Dr. Robin Ganser, president and CEO of American Humane. Dr. Robin Ganser, how are you doing today? David, I'm great. It's a wonderful day. Happy birthday, Betty. I know she's smiling down from heaven this very moment because we're talking about her favorite subject, animals. Absolutely. So first, let's talk, tell us about Betty White's involvement with American Humane and a little bit about what American Humane does. Well, American Humane uh, has had the privilege of working with Betty White for over 70 years. We were her very first animal welfare organization that she got involved with. Do you know when she started her television career and she was working with animals, American Humane was on set with our iconic No Animals Were Harmed program where we worked with animal stars and worked right alongside Betty White. Then Betty decided to join our governing board of directors. So she actually was one of our board of directors members for many years. She's also served an unprecedented three times as chair of our Be Kind to Animals Week, which is the longest running commemorative week in American history, where we celebrate our shared values of kindness, compassion, and love in humane education and really teach the value of the human-animal bond. And she was our national chairperson three times. It's, it's, and recently she was a judge on our Hero Dog Awards, where we honor heroes on both ends of the leash. She was so active in our organization and what a privilege to know her. It's very clear that she was very, she loved animals and that's very evident through those things. Did you have a chance to work with uh, Miss White over the years? I did, I did. She, she and I had many a time where we shared a meal together or a cup of tea. I know after our rescue and deployments uh, to save animals after natural disasters, I would bring my personal photos over to her, bring her a little book of my photos. And we'd sit down and she'd look at those animals in the eyes and would say, wonder how they felt that said i know how they felt after they were rescued she had such a connection by looking at an animal in their eyes photo or in real life and i tell you she was so much the real deal many a time she we would talk about animals and crisis and disasters and how she made such a difference in their lives by getting involved an amazing inspiration to me on a personal level too Okay, well, I'm very sorry for your loss, but we have been hearing a lot of good things about the Betty White Challenge. So can you, it's been making a, a splash across social media. So what is it exactly? Well, the Betty White Challenge is a chance for all of us to celebrate the legacy of Betty White, her loves of animals, compassion, and kindness by actually donating 5 or $10 to American Humane or your favorite animal welfare organization in your own backyard. It's a chance for us to gather these resources to really save millions of lives. I know that's why Betty's smiling today because so many animals are going to be saved in her memory. And again, five or ten dollars can go a long way in making a difference in the lives of an animal, food, medical care, and together these resources again will save lives. And Betty would want us to do that. All right. Be well, so happy. Dr. Ganser, thank you so much for taking the time to share that with us. And real quickly, where can people get more information if they want to contribute? You can visit AmericanHumane.org to learn more about our efforts to save animals. And again, thank you all for learning more about Betty's love, thank her you connection so with animals, and how that makes us better people. Thank you so much, Dr. Ganser. It's all the time we have to her, and thank you so much for joining us. Thank you, David.